Um, she's nudging me now. <laughs> Ow, she just bit me. Good morning, everybody. Uh, it's vlog day. I'm just filling up waters. Before we leave the house, very late. Okay. Let's quickly check the uh, greenhouse before we go. And everyone and everything is still doing good except for the seeds that aren't growing. But okay. So yes, we're on our way out to do this day. Fun. I'm in the usual ranting spot. Um, I have, I don't know if you guys, I know around the world people call them different things, but uh, mouth ulcers, um, like when you bite your lip and it turns into a sore, like in the inside of your lip. Um, I have one of them, but I have it at the back of my throat. Like right at the back on that like little gobbly punchy bag thing at the back of your throat, whatever you call it. Uh, so yeah, I have an ulcer on there. Now it's from what I can think is the only reason I can think of for having it and getting it is um, I made Milo the other day, but I put like, oh, like eight scoops of Milo in. And so the very last bit was like mud and it was very, very, very like rich chocolatey boning type flavor. And I'm thinking that that is what's caused it. I've drunk that, it's kind of like burnt my throat. That or the fact that, or and the fact maybe is like two reasons. Um, I was looking after a, um, yeah, I'm not even going to justify a friend, uh, looking after a person's cats, no dogs, so it's like you're looking after their dogs. But when someone asks me to look after the house or an animal, I'm going to make sure that everything on their property is going to be okay while it's under my care. And that's all fun and all, but her cats were screaming. I didn't know who was looking after them. They wouldn't give me a key. And um, they only rang up after I had, uh, they had already gone away. So I, I wasn't able to get into the house. I only had access to the two dogs in the backyard, but I looked through the cat flap and well, it was reportable. <laughs> I think the word would be probably best described. Uh, there was um the kitty litters were like right there but there was all shit over the floor and um i'm thinking that me putting my face right up against the cat flap trying to see if these cats are okay has contracted some sort of spores that aren't good so that on top of the um burning milo contributed to a ulcer on the back of my throat i cut my fringe also I was growing out if you've seen or you will see some of my recent gaming videos I haven't edited them yet but you'll see that they are um, kind of my hair's curled back so yeah also I was going to get a piercing today but because of my throat um, it's kind of irritated my other piercings so I'm not going to get the piercing this week but hopefully next fortnight I will vlog it Oh, and uh, it's currently quarter past 11 at around this time last week. Um, I got a call stating that my uh, the, the vets had an earlier appointment than 4.30 and that I was able to take my 17-year-old dog down and yeah, say goodbye to him, get him put down. Um, I haven't really talked about that on here. Uh, I've talked about it on Twitter, I think, and Instagram. But, um, yeah, he was 17 years old, blind, deaf, or going deaf. Um, and, yeah, he um, had these lumps on his head. Now, they weren't bothering him, so that's why we weren't too worried. Like, we, we knew what, we, what was coming, but we were hoping that, you know, it wasn't so soon. But, um, yeah, then, um, oh, about a week, almost two weeks now, I think, I, I don't know. Um, about a week and a half before we had to do anything um he started knocking it and everything and it was bleeding a bit in the last days and getting really irritated so we did what we had to do so yeah there's fucking christmas decorations up there they're really early and really late crown hotel in a location i'm not disclosing So we're on the way to check out Tenet. 
I'm just getting the price. $59. Alrighty. So I don't know if you saw that, but David Tennant is $60 for a standee. Now I'm going into this shop. So uh, this is what I wore today. I got my doc knee-high boots on and tank top with like netting and skirt and that is all. So I have my hair tied up. So um yeah, that was my outfit of the day. Reason I'm showing you is I got two compliments today from it. One person and a woman uh, decided to tell me that my style was very, very nice and she's happy that there are people out there willing to wear their own styles instead of wearing what every single other person is wearing. And, well, yeah, I don't wear what other people wear. Apparently it's not society's happiness or whatever. So, um, yeah, she gave me a compliment on that and I'm like, oh, cool, thanks. You know, that's, that's cool. It's non-creepy, genuine comment, uh, compliment, both. Um, the other one was I was at um, EB Games putting um, a bit of money on my pre-order and uh, this kid came up, old kid, he, he's got to be maybe 16, 17, he had an I, iPhone, uh, iPod, sorry, iPod, not an iPhone, and he was listening to music and he goes, hey, can I take a photo of you? I'm like, why? And the person behind the counter that served me, she's like, uh, why? And he goes, oh, I, I really like your look and, and you remind me of a game character. And the person behind the counter is like, oh, Chloe Price from Life is Strange. I'm like, yes, yeah, the hair, isn't it? And he goes, yeah, that and, um, what was it, Zoe from Resident Evil. Now, I don't know who that is. I Googled it and it's from the new Resident Evil, I think. But, um, yeah, apparently I reminded him of that. So, yeah, I let him take a photo. I'm like, yeah, all right, you know, if that's the only reason. Like, if it's creepy-wise, then no. But, yeah, that, that was pretty cool. So... That was uh, my happiness of the day, basically. I'm unloading the car now. Oh, I also got, can we, can we see, there's no number plates, no. Hey, $12 for a giant bale of hair that takes up the boot. Um, I will be putting that in the uh, messy garden that I'll be getting into this weekend. So that will be fun. Um, I thought I'd get into the garden this weekend. It's gonna be good weather and, well, it needs weeding, so. And the hay is to, Trying to stop the weeds. So, yay, stuff. Now I've got to unload the car. Fun. Also, it's um, like 2.30, so we're actually home early. We didn't do much today, though. So, I'm home now. You can see the other camera in the background. Should be using that right now. Um, I went to check on my piercing people. Um, I was going to find out how much and find out when they're booked in so that way when my throat clears up um, I can go and get a piercing but uh, my person decided to disappear um, the person I've been going to for one two three piercings now no longer works there so I'm gonna have to find another place because the people the, the replacement person doesn't do lip piercings so that's annoying so uh, there's one other place that is meant to be really, really good locally. So um, I'll check them out. I liked my person. Also, my person was like really good piercer. She was at a hair salon place, but she was still a really good piercer. And um, it was slightly cheaper. I know you meant to you like cheaper piercings equal like cheaper quality, but she was good. But anyway, I'll find another place. I am going for a nap. So I'll see you guys after. Three hours later. Hello again. I'm awake from my nap. Um, I got woken up by one of the, uh, I don't know if you guys know Sam, the big, big duck. Um, he was attacking one of the chooks. Now he's been doing that a lot lately and I've been intercepting it. But it's getting to the point where he's like really ripping into him. So um, I've locked him in the garage, put them in their coop. He's going to stay outside freely tonight. So he's separate from them. And then tomorrow I'm going to lock him into the garden out the back. Like the um, garden, garden to garden. You guys have seen that if you follow my vlogs. Um, it's all closed in. But I've kind of neglected it lately. So he can just go in there while the chicks come out. And I'm looking for a new home for him. It's kind of sad. He's four years old. He's a Muscovy Drake. But I can't have him attacking my chickens. 
So I've put it up on a local site hoping that somebody somewhere will be happy to take him in as a pet or as a, a breeding male because I don't really want him being eaten because that wouldn't be nice. But then again, he's four years old and so I've been told that, you know, not many people would want to eat a duck that, that, that is that old. So that's kind of a relief, but yeah. Um, I think that's about it. I'm going to edit this vlog very, very soon. I've got dinner on. Um, I mentioned about my piercing place, how the girl that was there moved away somewhere. So I am going to be going to a new place. That new place I also found out does dreadlocks. I didn't know that, so oh, mine are up in like a weird bun thing right now. But um, yeah, it'd be interesting to see how people do dreadlocks that are not done at home. Yeah, I, I they 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 charge to do dreadlocks, so okay. Um, I saw some photos and they're like burning the hair and and stuff. I, I don't I don't know, I don't know, but they're not touching mine. <laughs> mine don't get main, main maintained. I do my own. That's it. I've always done my own. I ain't paying someone to do something that I can do myself. Saying that though, um, if I could get the piercing supplies and I had enough courage to do that myself, I would. Probably wouldn't be that hard, but anyway. My throat hurts. I'm going to have dinner. I'm going to edit this vlog. I'm going to catch up on whatever TV shows I am missing. And I may even stream tonight. Some Horizon Zero Dawn. Um, tomorrow's Friday Fitness Gaming. I really don't have anything set for that. I need to get something done. I'll see how we go. Anyway. Uh, this has been like a, a boring kind of vlog this week. No complaints from anyone, or actually there was a complaint on that person with the cats and the dogs, but otherwise, no complaints. My phone through Optus is doing great uh, because of the 28-day credit thing. Um, I've put money aside to get that when it expires because it's on an off-pay week. Um, Telstra wanted to know why we cancelled. I, I ignored it. Um, what else? Polls online. I'm now getting text messages stating that my card didn't work, but they're still not fixing the system, but whatever. Um, I now have an Instagram. I had an Instagram before, but I have it locked. It's my personal one. So I now have an open Instagram that anyone can follow me, but if you are some sort of spam account with like free nudes, I will report you. I already did that today to one person and they have been removed for violating Instagram's terms and conditions on nudity and pornography. So, ha. Huh. Um, uh, the name is the same as it is everywhere else. X-O-W-O-X. You can find me on there. Um, if you find my personal account under Alex Beta, I will not be adding you. It's plain and simple. It's just it's my personal account. Um, yeah, I keep updates on this channel. Mainly, 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 moonly, my mainly. So yeah, go follow that. Um, I don't really follow back on there. If I know you personally, like if I talk to you on a regular basis, I'll probably follow you back, but that's about it. Find me on Twitter, XOWOX or Alex underscore beta. So that is my Twitter handle, I think people call it. Um, subscribe to this channel if you're not already. Um, I am in the process of doing a frequent vlog that I'll have a few things from last week in. Um, but I reached 100 subscribers. Um, I'll probably have to do a vlog about why that's not good and it is good. I'm happy for the 100 subscribers. I've got 106 as of today. So thank you everybody for that. I am grateful for the subscribers. But the, uh, I personally um, am not happy with the whole subscriber number versus the view number. I'm still hung up on all those numbers not matching up. So that's why I'm not going to do a major 100 subscriber thing. Um, I'm just waiting until the views start picking up. And then I may do a video celebration thing for that. I don't know. Anyway. Uh, yeah, subscribe to this channel, guys. Keep up to date. I will be doing some more streaming a lot more often one day soon um like this video if you liked it share it with your audience i always say that share my contents around with your audiences so that way i can find new audiences because you never know one person that you happen to follow might be interested in what i'm posting but thank you again everybody i hope you had a great day or night whatever time it is with you i've been talking to people in the 
time zones are like I'm like 18 to 20 hours ahead of everyone else and then there's people even ahead of me and it's like it's crazy but I hope you have a good time of day whatever it is for you um, I will catch you guys later be good to people see ya